Hey, this is Lego Preethan here, and today I'm going to be reviewing for you set number 76007, Molly Boo Mansion Attack. And, um, this is an Iron Man set, so... Okay. Um, and I'm first going to show the minifigures. I'm not sure if this is considered as a minifigure, but, um, I guess, yeah, again, I, in my previous reviews for the Emmet Mech, I guess Unikitty is supposed to be a build buildable figure. So I guess this one's also a buildable figure. And it comes with this backpack. I mean. Okay. Apparently I've had this for so long and it just snapped in half. I guess it's not noticeable. Okay. Pretend nothing happened. Moving on. Um, next character, um, this is supposed to be in, uh, it's supposed to be put over here in the set, and, um, this one also, it's not an actual minifigure as this is just a suit, and I think in my previous, um, custom minifigures, I've made, I've used this, this is the head I've used for making Slenderman, um, and over here you can put pepper in it. Or you can, you can put the character Pepper in it, or you can put Tony Stark in it. Um, that's that. And then I put the another suit that's supposed to display um, on the other suit picture over there. Um, shown right over here with the triangle chest. And I put it, it was working perfectly fine. And I got this from a pro promotional set, I think a long time ago. It was this and this buildable... Um, robot kind of thing and then this is Tony Stark this is Tony Stark and he has a double sided face um, and then this one is a glow in the dark figure which is one of the minions which I'm not sure glows in the dark anymore. Ah, uh, yeah, I guess it does. Yep, it does. And I guess he also has a double-sided face. This is the extremist version. And... Yeah, if you can't see properly, sorry. Yep, this is the double-sided face. And... The next one is Pepper Potts. And, um, she also has a double-sided face. Yeah. And the last one is Mandarin. He comes... This is not one piece. I mean, it's supposed to be separate. And he has a cape. Like, the Doctor Doom set. Um, I think it was Daily Bugle Showdown. And it appears to look like he has a kind of Iron Man chest arc reactor over there. And you're supposed to first put it over here. And then you put it over here. He also has a double sided face. Yeah, this is the base. And the second one is this. And now we will go to the actual set. I haven't reviewed all these sets for a long time. I think I mentioned that in a previous video that I made. So some of them are really old and the like all the pieces are cracked and they're pretty old, so So if one of my pieces break on camera, then I don't know. There you go. Mandarin once again. And now on to the actual set. 
I will first review this helicopter part of it. So it's a, like any other normal helicopter that comes in city sets or thing like that. And this is the opening cockpit. Or someone can sit in. And it has double flick fire missiles in both sides. And over here there are weapon slots where you can store your weapons. And now on to the actual set. Over here is the weapon story. I mean, these are not weapons. I mean, these are the tools that he uses to build a suit, I guess. Over here is the computer. Shows a bunch of pictures. And over here, just like the Daily Bugle Showdown, it's a op like a blasting window function. Like that. And here there's a blender, blending some juice, I guess. And then over here there's a cabinet, and over here there's a cabinet. And over here, this is an actual, There's this is a function that you can do on the back side of the set. So all you have to do is and it explodes apparently which is not a very good explosion because it flops two inches to the side um, and yeah that's it this th there's not many functions on this set as there are in others so uh, thank you for watching comment like and subscribe